Hello, today I will show how to make a working translator in Scratch. How we will make this translator work is our sprite here will, will ask you the word and which language and our sprite will say the translated word. So first we need to add the, the translator plugin into our Scratch. So for that, go over here and click and, uh, and find translates. It's over here. These should show up. So now we want to make two new variables. For that, we'll go to the, the variable section. From then that, we'll press make a variable and we'll name this variable word. We also need to make another variable. We need to call this one language. Make sure that the that these boxes are not checked. So now our cat when we want this to happen when the flag is clicked. So we'll put a when the flag clicked. After that, our cat will ask what word it wants to translate. So it will ask, well, what word do you want to translate? And then when, when you answer it, so see here, you can answer it. We want to set the word variable to the answer. So for that, we go to variables and place this over here. There. From the drop down section, select your word variable. Now go to sensing and drag the answer block over here. After that, it will ask you what language you, you want to translate that in. So it'll ask, what language? And then when you ask that, it'll set the language variable to your, to your new answer. So for that, we go to variables and put this one over here. And again, for, from the drop down menu, we choose language. Go to sensing. Drag answer over here. Now go to the looks section over here and drag a say block. Now go to the translate section and from the translate section put this over here. Now uh, go to variables, insert the word variable over here and insert the language variable over here. Now we made a basic translator. Let's test it out. Let's try translating the word hello to Spanish. And now it'll say that translated word. Subscribe!